Here's a pretty straightforward question. Is there any advantage to switching arms for the second dose of the COVID vaccine? Generally, the answer is no. By the time you get the second dose, any soreness from the first shot should be gone. Now, as an aside, I actually did switch arms just for curiosity's sake, and I can't say it made any difference. A viewer asks, will I test positive on a PCR test one week after I receive my first vaccine shot? The answer is no, at least not because of the vaccine. It is certainly possible to test positive because you became infected unrelated to the vaccine. The vaccine cannot cause a PCR test to become positive. Now, another viewer wants to know, how long does it take after the second dose for the vaccine to be effective? The most accurate answer, based on the data used to secure the emergency use authorizations, is that the vaccines were found to be 95% effective 14 days after the second Moderna shot and 7 days after the second Pfizer dose. The exact duration of the protection is unknown at this time. Another question. My daughter received the vaccine, and after about 5 to 6 days, the lymph node under her arm swelled up and became painful. Is this a common reaction? I would say it's not common, but it's also not surprising. People have noticed many unusual local reactions. This photo from a friend shows a very round rash that popped up seven days after the shot, right where it was given. Also not common, but clearly related. There's nothing you need to do. Her rash subsided in a few days, just as I would expect an enlarged lymph node to do. Now, if the lymph node doesn't go away or you have a fever or other swelling, you should talk to your doctor. Now, one final question that people are asking about the UK variant is if they can be infected if they already had COVID Classic. Now, the answer is we don't think so. While the new variant is more contagious in people without immunity, it doesn't appear to be different enough to evade the immunity from any prior infection.